All right, what is good, everybody? Welcome, welcome to the spiritual war room. I'm the Oracle here. I'm just, I just wanted to come do some readings for you guys to get you some extra support today. I'm feeling some kind, of, some energy of um, maybe a lot of conflict surrounding work, surrounding home. So we're gonna get you guys some advice. We're gonna pull, start by pulling a Archangel Power Tarot card um, to get the message for your overall. The energy for your overall message. The message for your overall energy. Thank you. <laughs> okay. The first card we have, two of Michael. It will all be better if you just make a decision over analyzing a problem. Find a compromise. A need for compromise. Okay. If you're overthinking everything, um, it could be a relationship. Making an offer. Okay, so let's see. Just make a decision. It will all be better if you just make a decision. You're trapped in your mind. What is the decision about? What is the decision in regards to? Okay, making an offer. It could be... It could be a work opportunity Knight of Pentacles, or you could just be make, moving really slow somebody could be very somebody could be just defensive towards you something you did in the past so you don't know how they're gonna react if you communicate block someone or stop communicating you don't know how they're going to react because they stop <clears throat> they could have been giving to you like maybe energetically even online and that stops so you don't know how they're gonna how they're gonna respond to your to you out um, reaching out to them just make a decision you're over you're overthinking everything find a compromise yeah, you're stuck in your head. You are burdened. You're like, well, you're so afraid of rejection. You're so afraid of rejection. You're so afraid of the communication. You're afraid of the message. But spirit says, you know, just... So this could be, okay, so there could be a fear of rejection here. Um, you're, you're the king of pentacles. Again, remember I said this could be maybe a, a work op offer. But this person has, this person that you're afraid of, uh, them calling judgment on you. You're, you're this king of pentacles, but this person has you feeling like this page. So because of whatever they said, whatever was hidden in, whatever you were doing behind the scenes, um, that's what, that's what you're afraid of. Uh, this person calling judgment on you or maybe having to admit that you did this. I'm getting two different stories. Like one could be a relationship where, you know, even the uh, same, same energy, this person is feeling very insecure about coming forward because they, they, they have, they put this person in the third party. They were juggling this person. Yeah. They would, you know, leave and go mess around they could have been messing around with people that they work with um 
you know, you found this out that, and you're like, no, you, you, you could have rejected this person. So this other person that wants to come and make a, <clears throat> like a romantic offer, this person is worried because they put you in a third party. The work person is feeling, um, burden be to come and communicate because of the conflict they created surrounding work and you could have moved away from this group and now they're burdened they want to they want to kind of draw you back in so they they want to like i want to say they want to celebrate you now but that's only because you walked away and they're now realizing that oh shit this this is the person that was going to make us all our money and now you know, we were being dickheads. We created burdens for this person. And this person moved on. This person knows and they moved on. And now this emperor is like, fuck, I don't, I don't know what to do. Mm. Don't overanalyze the problem, uh, the situation, okay? some cards and let's just pull some cards and get you some advice okay spirit's not gonna really tell you what to do this is yeah this you have to you have to seek the clarity you have to go within to find to get the message you can't spirits like I spirit almost wants you to connect to the universe to the divine to God whoever your higher power is even if it's you know just meditating Whatever you do to gain clarity, do that. That's where you're going to get this message. It's, it can't just be given to you. Yeah. You, it, this is just supposed to be guidance. It's ultimately up to you to decide how you're going to move forward. Um, you have to make the decision. But you need to quiet the mind and stop overthinking things and connect so you can find the best path to take for yourself okay all right i hope this helps all right let's pull another message what's the next message that wants to come through Page of Ariel, reliable, clever, educated, balanced. An excellent opportunity will be offered to you. Scholarships or the pursuit of education, time to get to work. Wow, okay. Somebody could be going to back to school. Furthering your education, I like that. This was a time of isolation, time to get to work. Um, maybe you were isolated with the hermit and you're finally coming out of that. Somebody knows that money's been slow for you, so that's why they're coming in with the scholarship or this opportunity for you. They're offering because of something that something that you've been doing for work. Um, do you see how there's cobwebs? Over, you know, somebody was holding up someone's money, so somebody was really slowing down, was trying to slow down someone's money. Bring, trying to bring it to an end. Yeah, they didn't. Trying to stop someone's money. 
so someone's another person's coming in maybe they've they've seen this and they're coming in to offer you the opportunity to yeah partnership they want to help you get out of this situation that you find yourself in you could be juggling a lot you could be kind of i want to say bound to your to, you feel bound to your circumstances so this person wants to come in and offer you an opportunity to kind of get ahead you might have a lot of options of where you want to invest your time your energy yeah so it's, there's a need to strategize you know best possible outcome if you don't know you don't want because you want to you want to move slowly you don't want to rush into something you know during this time of isolation, um, you've been you've been putting in the work. So now this is going to give you the, the the opportunity to expand whatever you've been working on. Um, you probably will be going to school for to further your education. So yeah, I can with this. Like yeah. There's, there's going to be a big change in your circumstances where you were feeling um, bound to maybe where a place, a job. There's good, yeah, you're over. I'm hearing overcomer, overcomer. You've overcome, um, <clears throat> but this will bring a big sudden change. It might come very suddenly. You, you probably aren't expecting it. Mm -hmm. All right. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's. Somebody's getting clarity about um, a group of people taking your money. Something, something that you did. Again, work, work. The work that you did exposed this, and so now that they have the clarity, they're coming in to communicate. Hey. Maybe that could be the, the job offer. Maybe, I don't know. Okay, I hope this helped, guys. Let's move on to the next, the next person that needs to hear a message. Okay, three of Gabriel. Prosperity arising from wise planning. Time to take the next step. Optimistic plans that turn out as expected. Wow. Prosperity arises from wise planning. So this could be a continuation of the last um, card. <clears throat> Time to take it the next step. Um, you could have ended out a cycle and it could have been pretty painful to end. But you understand that you had to end one one path to go down another. Not ending this would have rejected what was really meant for you. So there was a need to, to get away from this, you know, reject and put an end to the offer or uh, the offer um, to this path. You chose the path that is meant for you. The world, the hangman. You did, you could have been unsure if this was the path you you were supposed to take, but um, yeah. Take the next step. New cycles beginning. That looks great, man. With the you could be um getting into a new relationship as well. All right, that was nice. Okay, let's keep moving. There's not too much you need to know. Everything's going good for you. We have the two of Ariel and Justice. It's important to have balance. Working multiple jobs or, mo or projects at once, making work fun. Then we have Justice. Fight for justice and equality. Rules, Rulings made in your favor don't give up. So somebody could be dealing with some legal issues. Or this could be... Um, somebody who works in the justice system and it's they're overwhelmed and I don't know maybe maybe 
maybe this is what is coming in. They could be really overworked. Maybe this could be like an investigator doing um, kind of work. This may be, this might be a de detective. This could be detective work. Um, they might have lots of um, things going on. Fight for justice and equality. Or, or, or this, this could be an investigator investigating you? And they've had they had so much on their plate that whatever you were doing had brought like what is this you solved your own case <laughs> what the hell making making uh making work fun like whatever you did you whatever yeah you're having victory because of because you fight for okay so because you fight for justice and equality, um, whatever ruling, because again, I'm getting this person, th this person was investigating you. Um, whatever ruling is going to go in your favor, it might be shocking. There was a lot of people involved in this, yo. Oh my God. Yeah, that is coming to an end. There was a lot of people sneaky and trying to get you locked up. Whoa, whoa. So because of you fighting for justice and equality, you solved your own. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is crazy. I've heard other readers talk about something. Yeah, that's why they want to partner with you. Do you want to work together? priestess the hermit yeah you're fair you're wise you're balanced you you know and you don't do it for, you know you're not yeah you don't let what happened to you in the past you know it doesn't it doesn't change who you are in this present moment yeah. that's why they want to collaborate with you because they know that you're going to be fair ju and just you're not just going to uh, go after someone because of their race or their you know their religion their, their beliefs you know you, you know they know you're going to be fair And whatever you do, you make work fun. It's almost like you're finding you, you're bringing justice and balance to the justice system. <laughs> that makes sense. That's good. Good, good stuff. Okay, nine of Ariel. Your dreams are are fulfilled. Hard work leads to great success. A love, a, um, a love for uh, a love for the beautiful things in life. Okay, so don't worry. Your worry is unnecessary. Focus your thoughts on the outcome you desire. Release feelings of regret, guilt, or worry. Okay. So good things are coming, guys. Good things are coming. All right, let's keep going. Next card that wants to come out. We have two of Michael's. That, that came out. It'll... Somebody needs to make a decision. Then we have five of Michael. This situation does not serve you. Release your attachment to the outcome. Consider taking a more uplifting approach. Embrace your inner child. New friends or rekindled relationships. Children or childhood. Okay. I don't know why I feel the need to put that out. Okay. So again, with the needing to make a decision... You're overthinking something. 
it could be this emperor okay this emperor so this situation does not serve you release your attachment to the outcome consider taking a more uplifting approach what does this have to do what is it that you need to release conflict conflict competition and we have the page of wands okay so this emperor this situation does not serve you release your attachment to the outcome consider taking a more uplifting approach um so here is this king of swords this very intellectual king uh emperor right he knows it all then here comes the messenger the messenger brings the message and that sparks some kind of conflict some kind of argument and this um king of swords acts impulsively in this knight of wands energy this is very reckless impulsive um energy that right away wants to fight so this person brought a message and this one got angry and responded with probably getting a whole group to go against this one and for doing that for doing that that's why you're you're juggling your finances spirit says that's the truth the loss of finances is the burden for going after the person that it's like god sent to give you this message so consider taking a more uplifting approach yeah finding more balance in, within yourself um this to me screams like a need for for self-reflecting and some therapy to to yeah 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 okay to um embrace your inner child so there was something as a child that you weren't getting maybe from your father from your mother um and so that kind of led you into how you behave in the work environment maybe even in your relationships maybe even with the relationships with your children um there's a need to embrace your inner child new friends or rekindled relationships ch children or childhood so needing to go to your childhood stand up for what you believe and have confidence claim your personal power you need to yeah this this screams doing some inner inner you know shadow work and looking at the past especially the connection that you have with your with your parental figures all right all right that's what i have for you guys let's see i'll do one more we have the six of ariel Material needs get fulfilled in magical and unexpected ways. Acts of kindness, giving and re or receiving with a grateful heart. Okay. Whatever you manifested through your creativity, it, it could have... There could have been people that were blocking your manifestations from coming through but there's someone who's coming in to give to you and in doing so it's going to help you um, start to grow your abundance these people who try to slow you down and stop you they 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 are only blocking and stop in ending things for themselves Remember, guys, what you put out, you're going to get back. So if somebody was trying to block you, block your finances, slow you down, that's the energy they're going to be in. Oop, return to sender, right? Whatever creativity, whatever you've been trying to manifest is going to start to grow. Even though these people try to have you in this energy of lack, poverty, the truth is all that, you're going to you're gonna have abundance. You're going to, man, you could be buying a new house. I heard you're going to be getting a new car. Like it's going to be such a shocking, uh, turn of events. Like it's, it's going to be a very drastic lifestyle change for you, 
from rag, you know, rags to riches. Um, you could be relocating or moving with your son. With your son. I said page of cups. It's an empress, and, which is a mother, and the page of cups. So, yeah, you could have a son. Yeah, you're going to have a happy life, man. The star. Are you kidding me? You're going to be so fulfilled in your work. Like, man, you have good things coming. Even, and, and there you, you could have a lot of people trying to stop you, but. Good things are coming. Material need, uh, needs get fulfilled in magical ways. Acts of kindness, giving and receiving. Again, you know, pe pe people under, smart people know by giving to you, they're going to get in return. With a grateful heart though, not just because, oh, well, if I give to them, I'm going to get something in return. If, if it's coming from a selfish place, it won't materialize, you know, it won't come into fruition. So you have to give with a grateful heart. And that's, that's what this person is, is doing. They're coming in to give to you. Yeah, shocking. Maybe even, maybe even giving, like, there's a house. Money, oh my God. Wheel of Fortune, oh my God, oh my God. Yeah, so all this good stuff is coming to you. And then we have this King of Swords Emperor who's gonna be very disappointed. Because they're um, they're realizing that they um, rejected someone who is very abundant. Damn. Because this person was not giving from a grateful heart. They were giving to, from a place of superiority. I am better than you. So, yeah, it's just, you know. They should have been collaborating in a more loving, giving, you know, way to have victory. This person saw you as like beneath them and they're like, ugh, and they just, no. <laughs> so that's why they're losing out on all the abundance that this person is is coming into. Because they, they forgot how to give with a grateful heart. It's important to remember, guys, that when we're on top, that we help uplift others. It's not to look down on people. And if you do that, God giveth, God taketh away. So if you squander the blessings that God gives you, God's going to take them away from you. Just um, be mindful of that, guys. When you're on top, be a good leader, all right? All right, guys, I think I'm going to leave it there. I hope these readings helped you today. Um, yeah, don't forget to check out the description box for more information on how to schedule your own personal readings if you feel called to do so. Okay, guys? If not, and this is where I leave you, have a great one.